We begin our bulletin with the unemployment crisis in the country, which seems to be growing out of hand. The Kenya National Bureau of Statistics puts the figure of unemployed Kenyans at 2.97 million, with those between the ages of 20 and 29 being the most affected at 1.54 million. Our reporter, Gatete Njoroge, was on hand to record the disturbing scenes when 2,000 job seekers who traveled from across the country braved the early morning calls to try their luck in securing slightly more than 100 courier jobs advertised by G4S security company. Take a look. <laughs> Friday, 8 a.m., and thousands of job seekers line up inside the G4S Training Academy in Mbakasi, Nairobi. From Rusinga to Bungoma to Trukana, Kenyans from across the country traveled for what they believed could be the opportunity to get employed as courier clerks. Most of them who traveled from far had bags containing all their important documents with those from nearby carrying envelopes. But as time passed, their hopes diminished as most were disqualified based on age and lack of original academic certificates. We found Lucas Sobudo from Rusinga Island sitting on the road in deep thought. He left Kisumu last evening to try his luck 350 kilometers away, only for him to be dismissed for failing to fulfill the age requirement set by the recruiters. Obudo is 24 years old, but according to the advert, those interested in the position should be between 25 and 35 years old. Parents walikuwa najua nitapata kazi huku, sijapata. Then pia, okay, Kenya likuwa tunategemi anga sana, hii, nini, hii mambu ya kazi mtani, venye ilikuja, ilikuwa na tusaidia. Sayu, sayu kitembea lakeside saa hii, kazi, kazi mtani hakuna, fishing pia. Fish akuna, sayu, utapata vijana wengi wako kwa bangi. Obudo is not alone. Most of those we spoke to shared with us the challenges of looking for a job in the country. Kitu imenitoa huku ndani ni miaka ni 25. But next month, Tharetisa ndiyo nafikisha 25. So no, na nimechoma transport kutoka western hadi huku. Inafata ina nirudi huko. Overnight. Unapata unamua kuenda Saudi. Ile nye unatafuta kazi, una, unazurura, unazurura, unachoka unenda Saudi. Wanatukataza tusiende. Tusiende na Kenya watupei kazi. Sinile utatafuta ukisha choka, unatafuta kuenda Saudi. Tukufia huko, unamua heri, ukufia huko. Nilimaliza shule 2011. Uh, Kutako muda wote, sijapata tuile kazi kamili. Some of us went for parallel programs. So we don't have the money to clear the fees so that we can get the certificate. So we have come to look for jobs so that we can clear, we get our certificates and look for other means. With age and experience, one of their main concerns in failing to get jobs, job seekers between the ages of 20 and 29 have challenged the government to seek other employment opportunities for them apart from the housing program. Wezi niambia niende ni kangangane na wanaume pale tujenge nyumba. Aya pia yo sekta ya ujenzi yo yenye wanafanya, wanasema kuna mjengo. Tayari kuna wenye wako kaiyo kwa hiyo kazi. Sasa uniambia pia sisi tujiongeze hapo. Ovia satuwezi toshia si wate kwa mjengo. Unaona. So kitu yenye naiza sema, watafute kazi zingine. Many here fear that the situation will get worse soon following the government's proposal to increase taxes in different sectors which could lead to job losses and deem their prospects of getting their dream jobs. According to the Kenya National Bureau of Statistics data release in April, more than 2.97 million Kenyans are jobless, an increase from 2.89 million people who were jobless in September 20. 2022.